In this video, I will show you how to create a course export file and download it. Creating an export of your course is a good way to have backup copy. Please note that user data isn't exported, so for example, if you wanted to export the Dropbox, none of your students' uh, assignment submissions to the Dropbox would be exported. In addition to backing up your course, uh, the course export is also a good way to share resources with other instructors. For example, if you created a rubric, you could export uh, that rubric and then allow another instructor to import it into their course to use. So to get started, on the course homepage, you'll want to locate the course admin. Select course admin and choose edit course. From here, you'll want to go under site resources and select import export copy components. And now it defaults to copy, but we're going to choose export. Note that you'll probably want to keep the course files as part of the export package. It may make the course a larger size, but for most people, you're going to want to keep this selected. You'll choose Start Below, and now you can either select all the components or come through and pick and choose the components you'd like. You can even select individual items to export, but for the purposes of this video, we'll just select all, come down to Continue, Continue, now, confirm. If any of these items I've changed my mind, I can always click Modify and go back and make changes. If I'm all set, I choose Continue at the very bottom. Now, it's very important when your course is exporting to allow it to go all the way through each of these items and to not interrupt it. And here we are. Once you see all these green checks, that means that you've had a successful export. Note, if you do see any red X's or warnings or errors, it's probably a failed export and you'll want to go back and retry exporting your course again. And here we have the export summary. Note, you'll need to click here to download the zip package. Once you select the link, you'll see that the download begins. It may take a few seconds, it may take a few minutes, depending on the size of your course.